Joey Votto hangs up his cleats. Judge is smashing baseballs like it's 2022. And the World Series is anyone's game. Plus, a comedian pitches his way into the record books. Literally. Touch them all is coming up next. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Sports Knots Weekly MLB Digest. Touch them all. I am your host, Scott Cole Branson. There's so much to get to. We're diving right in head first now. So let's go. First up, Joey Votto, Mr. Cincinnati himself, has officially called it quits after 17 incredible seasons with the Reds. Votto tried to make one last comeback with the Blue Jays, but an ankle injury had other plans. Now, instead of suiting up in Toronto, he's calling it a career from a parking lot in Buffalo. Hey, at least it's not Tim Hortons. Votto, just shy of 41, leaves behind a legacy that's bound for Cooperstown. Six-time All-Star, 2010 NL MVP, and an on-base machine. Votto ranks second all-time in Reds history for homers and doubles. But As he put it, to the very last pitch, I gave my all. And we believe you, Joey. Congrats. Meanwhile, Aaron Judge is doing Aaron Judge things, smashing baseballs into orbit. With two more homers this week, Judge is up to 47 on the season and is pacing for another 60 homer campaign. I mean, listen, is anyone else getting serious 2022 vibes here? The Yankees are back on top of the AL East. If Judge keeps this up, they might just slug their way back into the World Series. And speaking of the Yankees, who's winning the World Series this year? Honestly, it's anyone's game. I've got 10 teams with 70 plus wins, but not a single clear cut favorite in sight. The Dodgers are limping, but still dangerous. The Yankees are flexing their muscles and the Phillies are hanging tough. But don't sleep on the underdogs. The Padres are heating up at just the right time. The Diamondbacks are channeling last year's magic. And even the Royals, yes, the Royals, are making noise in the wildcard race. This October is shaping up to be March Madness with bats, balls, and way too many sleepless nights. Buckle up, because it's going to be a wild ride in Major League Baseball. And finally, let's talk about the real MVP, comedian Eaton Levine. This guy just set the Guinness World Record for the most ceremonial first pitches in a year. 40 and he's not done yet he's out here living the dream raising money for make a wish and throwing baseballs at every stadium he can find levine's not just pitching for the fun of it as a childhood cancer survivor himself he's giving back to the organization that made his wish come true and if that's not a perfect way to wrap up this week in baseball i don't know what is all right make sure to subscribe to the sports not youtube channel and don't forget you can't hit anything if you don't swing first we'll see you here on touch them all next week